And then I went and I got this for you. <laughs> Good morning everybody, hope you're all doing wonderful on this Sunday morning. You're definitely not watching this on a Sunday, but maybe you are actually, maybe you are. I hope you're all doing wonderful. This morning has been a little bit of a slow start. You guys, there's the proof. The time is right there. It's 11.20, almost 11.20. And it's Sunday and I'm feeling good, okay? Woke up this morning, changed the bed sheets. I feel like Sunday is the best day to change your bed sheets. Sunday or Monday, you know, so I had to do that. And then I put the dirty sheets in the laundry, so that's going on right now came to the kitchen, made myself a coffee. Why did I almost break the coffee machine? I don't know what happened, but something went wrong and I will get my handy dandy man to fix that afterwards. Um, and then I have been loving Americano Mistos in the morning. So Americano, like a normal Americano is espresso and hot water, boom. I have it with like a, a splash of milk. So I've been using oat milk a lot, not a lot, just lied. I've been using usually soya milk or soy milk, but I just got oat milk a couple days ago and today was actually my first time having it with oat milk and honestly, it tastes the same like soy milk. It's just a swash anyways. So I've been having this, loving it, still not done yet. It's a little bit cold, honestly, not gonna lie. <laughs> you guys know me and coffee. One day I like it, one day I don't. Some weeks I don't, some weeks I do. It is what it is. Right now, I'm just in my Americano Misto phase. I think it's just because like the espresso here is so strong that when I have just espresso, anxious all day. Anxious all day. Um, unless it's like the right timing. It's very weird. My body's very weird. But sometimes I feel like I plant that into my head, you know? But it is what it is. So I'm still finishing my coffee. I did my devotional this morning, my Bible study. You guys saw that. It was... It's always great. It's always great. I always feel wonderful afterwards and love that for me. So now that I'm done with the Bible study and devotional, I can actually put this away. It's so heavy. So It looks like so many things, but it's just like normal stuff. Notebook, Bible, devotional, pen. This is where my stuff always goes, just underneath here, because I always do my Bible study here. And one time I did do it in my bed though, that was just... I was very lazy, but I wanted to read the Bible, so I'm like, how can I put two in one? You know? You know. This is what it is. Okay, so now, as I said, it's Sunday. I'm home alone. I feel like every time I do a vlog, I'm always talking about how Andrea is at a pool tournament, and again, he is, so that's, we'll just leave that where it is. I almost never go to the gym on Sundays. I think I have maybe one time whilst, <laughs> I never say that word whilst, whilst living here and today I want to go to the gym and I want to work on my legs. Oh my gosh, the outfit. Guys, sometimes... What is that sound? Oh my upstairs neighbor's balcony. <laughs> I just saw my face in the viewfinder. Why did I look so disgusted? Anyways, I definitely want to finish my coffee then go to the gym, but I don't know if I should pass by the pool hall on my way to the gym because I said I would go see him, like see a little bit of his tournament, but I don't, first of all, obviously the more he wins today, the longer he's at the pool hall today. So I don't know if I want to go to the gym, come back home, eat, shower. By then, I don't know where he's going to be placed in the tournament depending on like where the actual tournament is i usually just try to see the scores i don't know what's going on i can't see the scores for this one so maybe we'll pass by there before we actually go to the gym because it's kind of around the same area i'm gonna be doing a lot of steps today a lot while i'm finishing like you guys can't even see why would i do that <laughs> imagine the spills i will cry but I just have very little amount of coffee left. I'm gonna finish this while posting a video on TikTok, one of my drafts, and then, you know, get ready because this, it needs to change.
I feel a little bit better considering the fact that I rinsed my face, cold water in the morning, got to do that. Put a little bit of mascara on just because, I don't know, I'm feeling the mascara at the gym. It just makes me feel alive, a little bit more awake, alert. It's 15 degrees right now, which is honestly not bad, but I'm already cold. So I'm gonna put on my buffer layer, which is just like a sweater. And then after I put on my jacket, um, I'd rather be a little bit warm than a little bit cold, you know? I also have to hang the clothes outside to dry because the laundry is done. So let's do that. Wow. This is my friend's brand, by the way, Wake the Health Up. I don't even know if she still sells these sweaters, but love this. And I can't like wear it as like a real, real sweater. If that makes sense. What I'm trying to say is like, I got, I washed it with something else. I don't know if you guys can see it. But there's like some red dots in the back and the permanent so it's like my buffer sweater as in when i want to be warm inside or if i have to go outside just to keep me a little bit more warm so it's still doing its job i'm still getting my use out of it but i just cannot be walking down the street like this because it looks like it's dirty Anyways, let's go get the laundry out and then we can finally start walking to the gym. I literally never show you guys this room because I always say it is so messy and it is. And I always say the same reason why because it's true. Andrea has taken it over and it's, it's it literally looks like what you think like a man's, not even a man's room, but just it's a mess. It's a mess. So this is why this angle is very awkward. Also, something is not right. Like, I'm not straight right now, obviously. So I need to fix that. This is, this is the best angle I can find. So let me get the clothes. They're clean sheets. And then I have a few other random stuff I threw in there. So let's see how I can figure this out. I honestly could not tell you why the ground is like half wet. Did it just rain that I missed? I don't know, but it's not supposed to rain, so. My actual pet peeve is putting the clothes outside to dry and then it rains because I'm like, okay, now I have to wash them again, dry them again. Now I'm making pre-workout to take with me to the gym. I'm really trying to have a great life day, I guess. Scoop. Did you guys see that? Oh yeah, you did. I mean, did you guys see that? A scoop and a half. A normal serving is, yeah, two scoops, so I don't even take a normal serving. I know a scoop and a half sounds like a lot, but in the grand scheme of things, I'm taking less than a serving. This is always on the side. I actually want to get my, put my gym card in my pocket. Because I hate, like, I always have my gym card in my bag, and then, like, Literally always at the same spot, down the street from my gym, I'll take off my bag, go in the front, get my car, put my... We don't need to do that. So I have this warm water, but... One second. <laughs> the cold water is what I want to take with me. Also, I've had, like, these gym resistance bands. This is the large size. I have obviously small, medium, and large. I never use them. And now I want to be like, okay, I want to start activating my glutes before doing my leg workout, leg glute workout. Um, because I'm trying to build a dumpy. <laughs> I feel like I'm forgetting something. Water, resistance band, towel, umbrella. That's it. Cause I, oh, this is what it is. I usually have an extra shirt because you guys know me. I hate feeling wet after the gym. You know, like I don't mind it obviously when I'm sweating, but as soon as I'm finishing my cool down stretch, the minute after I'm like, oh, this needs to come off. So I don't have an extra t-shirt because I'm just gonna take obviously my gym shirt off and I have my sweater. So that's good. 
I need to just drink some warm water because I'm feeling a little, I feel the caffeine. I don't know why, but I just have an urge to make sure that my gym closes at 2 o'clock today on a Sunday rather than, I don't know, what if they changed it? Right, okay, 2 o'clock. That's good. I honestly feel like I need to go to the washroom before I leave, so BRB. Okay, I'm leaving the house now. I'm ready to go. My camera's at 8%, so we're going to be charging... No, the gym closes at 2, so I have to go to the gym first. Oh, yeah, the doctor come. There is hey, my girlfriend. Yeah, the, there is the girlfriend. Okay. And uh, at least I speak English. Speak oh, English. okay. And then, like, same story. <laughs> <laughs> ah, okay. But um, the gym closes at 2 o'clock, so if yeah, you're still... Okay. I have to find on my phone exactly how to get there because... Street. Yes, I know the street, but I want to check with my phone. So you guys heard it first. He lost the first one, won the second. He has his third coming up very soon. I'm going to the gym first, and then after I will go there, and I'll bring you guys along. My camera is going to be charging here, but don't worry. I'm going to get all the things I need to get on my phone. So see you soon. finished with the gym that was actually a pretty good workout now I'm walking to the pool hall it's about a four minute walk I've never walked there before so I'm just I don't know following my map going with the flow but yes today wasn't even really a hard workout it was just more of like maintenance so it was great I was so lost and then I looked up and I'm like oh there's this bike and there's the pool hall walk in with me why am I always nervous I'm going in by myself I got to ring the doorbell. Buongiorno. <laughs> Come on, stay. Okay. Good. Andrea. Yeah. Okay. Grazie.
guys it's a little bit later i don't know what happened with my camera battery but it says battery exhausted don't know what that means never saw that in my life so i'm gonna have to figure that out so right now i'm using my phone i'm having this soup i know it doesn't really look like soup it's like a thick soup you know and then i added like seitan inside for um extra protein i just realized this really looks like chili more than soup i guess i'm having like a, a source of chili some kind of chili I'm gonna finish this and then we're gonna walk to Sephora because I need to get makeup remover. I usually use the pharmacy, I think it's called pharmacy melting balm or something like that, but I am completely out of it and I need to get some makeup remover. So we're gonna do that. And then I think I might get Andrea like a bottle of cologne because the one he had finished and then he got some random one like just for now. And honestly, didn't tell him this, but I can't stand it. I can't stand the smell. It's just like, it smells cheap and I, I have to change it for him. I have to. So that's what's happening right now. Um, I chilled for a bit after my shower because I was just like, just had to take a, a deep breath, you know? So hopefully I'm even in frame. I don't even know. <laughs> yeah, let's just finish this and then head head on out. My camera's actually working. I just checked. I think when I was charging it, when I left to go to the gym, I didn't charge it correctly. Something went wrong. Maybe I left my camera on, but I was charging my battery, which is why I said battery exhausted. I don't know, but I just checked it and it's charging and it's at 17%. I'm not getting that battery exhausted message anymore. So why am I using my phone? <laughs> I'm just using it for now until my camera charges. The, um, I haven't really talked about this too much, but I love my new camera but it's not really the best for vlogging because the stabilization in it is very bad. So like every step I take, it's like this and it's very hard to like make it, you know, not move that much. Maybe I just have to use my mini tripod more with my camera when I'm out. I'm gonna try that. What the F? <laughs> um, but yeah, that's sad. I'm just gonna put some, I don't know, stuff on my eyebrows. Maybe do like a wing liner and some mascara and then just leave because as you can see outside, it's dark. It is, I don't know what time it is, but Sephora closes at 8.30. I'm planning to be there around 6.30 and then go and get the makeup remover and the clone. <laughs> Why did I almost forget for a second? There was also like a two hour window where I stopped filming for a bit because after a tournament, if he doesn't win or like not in the top three or just like not proud of the work he did throughout the tournament, his mood is sour, okay? And his mood literally reflects onto me, which is honestly annoying. And I'm trying to like work on that. Like just because you're sad doesn't mean I have to be sad. Like, yes, I can feel sad for you, but I don't have to change my mood because of you, if that makes sense. Um, yeah, so I just like stopped filming for a little bit. And it was also like, I don't know, just, I didn't want to have the camera in his face or whatever. So I'm like, okay, let me, let me let you cool down. And then he cooled down <laughs> and now we're good, but... Yeah, that is just something I, I don't know, I have to get used to or either just, I, I just know what happens now. If we go to a tournament and he doesn't do great and he's not proud of how he did, the mood is going to be sour for a bit, a couple hours. And then he just does this thing. Like in Bolzano, when we went, he's like, okay, I got to go to the steam room, got to go to the pool, got to, I'm like, okay, go do your thing. And then came back, everything was good. But yeah, um, I'm rambling right now. Let's let's do this. Ever. I'm going to actually get my actual camera out while I do this. This is a crazy angle. Like, what am I doing? What am I doing? I don't know why. I have a sneaking suspicion that Andrea is going to find me in the area that I'm going in. And I really don't want that to happen. Number one, I do feel like I have to branch out on my own, you know, and doing my own thing, my own evening. And number two, it's going to ruin the surprise. Okay, let's, you guys know, you guys know. Honestly, I don't even really need to do my eyebrows like that. I don't know why I am, but let's just do a little. My walk there is gonna be about half an hour. I'm gonna be walking around for like an hour, half an hour back, so about two hours, which is good. I'm really trying to implement more movement this month for sure. I always say, like, what's the point of going to the gym and staying home all day? Oh, let me just make sure my phone is charging. It's not. Okay. Got a good 25% on my phone, so that's fun. I hope I leave the house with a good, I don't know, 
Can I even be on the World Wide Web like this? I don't know. I don't know. Can anyone relate to this? You know those outfits you wear when you know you're not gonna take off your jacket? Like, does that make sense? Like, it's not really an outfit that's actually put together, but with your jacket on, since nobody can tell, like, it's fine. And that's kind of what I'm going for right now. Like, I'm gonna be outside literally most of the time, so I don't really need to have it so cohesive. And I don't plan on talking to anybody besides those people who work at the store. Should I bring a scarf? I don't know. I also, I just realized right now, why do I have to, like, why is it set up like this? Yeah, like, I think I know the look I was going for artistically in my mind, but I didn't need to do all of that. Like, I could just have the camera facing me, like a normal, the normal person, you know? Anyways, I'm trying to figure out if I feel cold or not. Like, yes, right now I feel a little bit chilly, but like, should I bring a scarf? That's, that's a good question. My battery is at 3%, wow. This is what my eye makeup looks like, by the way. It's just matte, matte eyeliner, a little bit of eyebrow stuff, eyeliner stuff on the bottom. Why do I call it eyeliner stuff? It's literally just eyeliner and mascara. Okay, so I'm gonna see you guys when I'm outside because my battery is literally dead. I've literally been walking for like five minutes and I'm already starting to get warm, so I overdressed once again, but it's okay. Oh my God, I almost saw an accident. This is like normal here though. Everyone's always just like running into each other. Guys, I was trying to figure out why I'm literally out of breath. I looked down, I'm like, oh, it's because I'm going uphill. That is why I literally cannot breathe right now. Jesus, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. I think I'm about like five minutes away. And then once I get there, I'm gonna take the deepest breath. I have water on me. What am I doing not drinking my water? That's a big question. not the makeup remover that I was looking for because I knew they didn't have it but I got this other one from Clinique I hope it's good it's a cleansing balm and then I got the KP body scrub thing because I do have some KP on the back of my legs so I'm like might as well get that now I'm walking into the store to get Andrea's per not perfume cologne it's so busy around me I can't even find the one that he has there's so many options and I do not feel like smelling any of them so I have to pick one that he's definitely had before. Still don't see them here. Wow. I see it. Invictus, he's had before. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's okay. Invictus, he's had before, and the Womo. So I think I'm going to get the Womo one. Guys, I've been out here for about half an hour. I'm already, I'm already done. I'm already done. Do you see around me? Do you see all those people around me? It's too much. I'm going to a bookstore now because I want to find highlighters for my Bible study. <laughs> I see these, but I feel like they're gonna bleed through the sheets. At least these ones definitely look like they will. They're so thick. But I think I might just have to take a gamble. Maybe go with. I feel like why is there no yellow? They just look so thick. I don't know. Sorry, but look how cute these are. Honestly, don't know if they're gonna bleed through or not, but should I get pastel or regular? They're like what, four euros. I don't know. I think I'm gonna just get regular. Pastel is. No. I don't know, guys. I think I'm gonna get both. I'm gonna get regular, and if I really like them, I will come back for the pastel. I'm done. This was a very quick outing. Got the stuff that I needed, and now let's go. I see all these little shops here and I'm like, this was not here last week. So is this like a Christmas thing? I don't know. Let's go browse around, I guess. I'm out of the crowd, guys. I'm safe. 
<laughs> no, I've always been safe the whole time. But I just feel free. I don't have to like be bumping into anybody. I'm basically, I'm not on my street, but um, where am I? <laughs> I'm not on my street, but I just have to keep walking all the way up the street to meet my street and I'll be home. So yeah, I'm done. Wow. I'm definitely at 10k steps for the day. I have to be. I literally have to be. Also, why am I just taking in that I've been recording on my back camera, which is like good if you're using your phone, but I've been doing it like on 1x and I should have been doing it on 0.5, I think, so you can get more of me in the background. Oh Lord, I just looked at my last clip just for like a quick second. I'm like, why am I like this? <laughs> the way that I'm walking in this specific area, Andrea's always like, never walk here because the mafia <laughs> owns the bars. So why am I walking in the middle of fate? Why am I walking here? I gotta get out of this specific area. Back into the public. Can I? No, no, no. Let me not pretend like I'm in Toronto where I can just cross wherever. Here, literally cross at the cross rock or it's, um, what's that game called? Russian Roulette. Russian Roulette. Did you guys see that? How close that car was? Almost ran over my foot, but it's normal. So I'm not even like, like it's in the past now, you know? If that happened in Canada, I'd be freaking out like, oh my God, they almost ran over me. Here, it's like, just expect to almost get ran over, but don't, oh my God. I'm gonna get I'm doing a, like a little cake thing from here. Okay, that was so last second. But basically, I went in, got him like a little strawberry cake thing. It's just like a mini cake. He always says like he loves it. Never buy it. He's like, no, I can't have it. I can't have it. But then you'll get the chocolate one. But I don't know which chocolate one because as you guys can see, there were so many flavors, so I didn't know which one to pick. So I just picked the safe option, but I'm ready to go home. Put the evidence in my bag. I just have a feeling that he's This I've been hearing about a lot, so I hope it works. KP is like, by the way, I didn't even explain. KP is like kind of like when people say a strawberry skin, or some people say chicken skin, but I don't understand the chicken skin <laughs> with the strawberry skin. This has 10% AHA in it, so it's definitely going to be strong. You're supposed to use it once a week, once or twice a week. So let's hope that works. Come here, please. I need you to sit down on this chair. I'm boxing. But I need you to also to put this down. I smoke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but not in this instance. Anyways, let me show you the things that I got, okay? So I got this to take off my makeup mm -hmm. because the other one is finished. This is not the one I like, but beggars can't be choosers. This is Italy. This is Italy. Trust me. This. Well, this is Clinique. Yes. It's one of the best brands. Yeah, but it's not the one I want. You know, I don't care if it's the best if I want. Anyways, this is something else. It's just for my skin. Like, uh, I don't know how to explain it, but it's for my body. Okay. They gave me this for free. It's for like my eyebrows, but whatever, you know? And then I went and I got this for you. <laughs> I didn't know which one to get you, so I got you something you already had before because I don't know what, <laughs> I don't know your nose. So I know you like this because you have the old bottle, the empty old bottle, and then we can throw that out. Thank you. <laughs> because I want to. And then, that's just the receipts. I also got a Sephora card for Italy because I have one for Canada. And she said, do you want one? I said, okay. So this is free. Another receipt. 
And then I went and I got you just a little treat. But I don't know if you're gonna like the flavor. <laughs> because I didn't know he wanted the chocolate. <laughs> okay, be careful. It's gonna. <laughs> Strawberry and shanty cream. Yes, and I was talking to the women so much. Oh my god, they're. <laughs> <laughs> you like your stuff? This is why I wanted to go alone. I wanted to do my own thing to get you some stuff. <laughs> yeah, this before. I know, that's why I got it. It's gonna I was gonna get this or Invictus. But I said Invictus you had lots, so maybe I didn't want to get something different because your nose is different. Oh guys, no no no. Oh my love. So now the other one you can stop using because I, I don't like it. Hmm? The Alcott one, I don't like it. Me too. Don't yes, this you. is this makes me wanna anyways, I hope you like your stuff. I also got mm -hmm. highlighters, mm -hmm. but for my Bible. I don't know what it is, but today I'm just loving this angle with the mirror. The mirror is the star of the show today. Anyways, it looks like no time has passed, but actually 20 minutes have passed by. I took a great shower. It is like, what, maybe 8.30 now, almost 9, I don't know. But I'm going to probably make myself something quick to eat because I do have to edit my podcast, episode 3, talking all about the fear of judgment. Um, tomorrow's going to be a long and busy day. I'm going to be with my friend who... Friend? plus her friends. So I'm going to be with friends um, that, are, that came here from Canada. They're in Rome right now and they're coming to Naples tomorrow. So I don't have time to edit tomorrow. Maybe I'll have some time like towards the end of the day, but I want to edit as much as I can today and then just do the final touches tomorrow to have it scheduled for Tuesday because my podcast comes out every Tuesday. Guys, this is actually so embarrassing as a block person to say, but why do I have no moisturizer? Like, yikes. And I didn't like think about it until I was showering. I was like, why didn't I get moisturizer when I was out? Like, yes, they have moisturizer at the convenience store and I don't know what it is. It must be something with like Nivea in Europe or Nivea in Italy, but all I can see is Nivea everywhere I go. And I'm like, you know the Nivea, the original Nivea in the blue tin or the blue bottle, whatever. I don't want to put that on me head to toe or like at least it's not going on my face for sure. Neck to toe because it's just so like, greasy and it's so heavy and i don't want that moisturizer <sighs> gosh i definitely could have got one when i was out today so this is my confession to you guys i for the past week maybe past two weeks <laughs> honestly like less than two weeks but like at least 10 days i haven't had moisturizer i use like hand moisturizer obviously <laughs> but um yeah it's been a little bit of a problem so i have to like keep that in my mind because tomorrow we're going to be around like the shops area so i can definitely buy a moisturizer then otherwise now i'm just i i literally for the past 10 days i just been moisturizing my face and my hands like what kind of life am i living can tell ya. you guys see that right here synchronized clips this has honestly saved my life it is the best thing ever. I'm just going to press OK for that. Guys, this is what I'm having for dinner. I already started eating some artichokes. Don't mind how it looks physically. Um, I'm just hungry, but I don't have the energy to cook something that actually takes a lot of time. So basically, this is what I made. Don't love how the barbecue sauce is on some of the artichokes, but we will live and it's fine. And yeah, let me just eat this quickly and head back to my bed. Okay, obviously I'm gonna have some dessert. So this is called Grisby. Grisby? <laughs> to say it with an accent. Um, I don't know. I don't know what it is, but it's vegan, as we can see. And um, we got it today at the grocery store. So actually, mostly Andrea got it. I didn't even see it until we were like at the checkout. But let's see how this tastes. There's a... There's a picture, there's a little hazelnut there and I see chocolate, so I feel like it's gonna be like, then not vanilla, <laughs> like vegan Nutella kind of. I don't know. Guys, I'm so tired. I need to sleep. 
Okay, so they look like this, just a regular cookie. And inside it's like a nice chocolate, literally like vegan Nutella. It's very good, but definitely dangerous for me to have in the house. And why did he buy two packs? It's really crispy and crackerish on the outside, or I guess cookie-ish. On the inside, soft. Christmas together. Our first Christmas together. Wow. I can't. We have to get the pajamas. It would be beautiful. It would be beautiful. <laughs>